my outfit today. I can't really see anything at all, can you? But you know what? It is raining, just like the weather said. Today it was I was going to go to a pumpkin patch. Um, and then I woke up this morning, and you know when you wake up, you just make like all these excuses for yourself. So I'm like, you know, I shouldn't go. Let me check the weather, you know. So I checked the weather. It was like, it's raining. I can't go to a pumpkin patch. It was raining. And then it ended up not raining. All the hours it said it would. It kept getting pushed. And then now it's just like a light drizzle, you know, I'm just going to go there anyway. But anyways, the first place I'm going to go is to get, I mean, you'll see what I get. But um, basically, I'm like so loud. I'm waking up like my neighbors. But yeah, I'm waiting for a ride right now. I use Lyft, not Uber, because I don't know. I just had bad experiences with Uber because I always used to order them. They never used to show up or... You should say like they're coming and they're not coming and then I just gave up and I think it's the ones that they have. Okay. And it's going a matter of health 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 okay. So what I would need to pierce her since her like I don't think her school oh, has like a little, oh, I like the little I'm gonna do a video out here because it is raining, so I'll just make it really quick. I just wanna show you before a piercing two years ago and it got rejected is because I went to Six Flags and uh, it was my boyfriend at the time. We went on these rides, and then the bar on the on the roller coaster like it pressed against my belly button. And then I was in the shower, and I kind of feel like it was really, really like swollen, weird, and like my belly button ring just like pushed like straight out. It was like the weirdest thing that ever happened. So yeah, I left it out for the rest of the time there. I need to remember to buy that salt spray when I get here. So I'm gonna get it done today, and I'm really excited. And I picked out my ring. Pretty sure you know which one it is, but you'll see it. And here it is. Yeah, I really like it and you won't believe where I'm going next. It's my first time ever. I'm gonna take some pictures. Roasted corn smells really good. Hot drinks. I was like, the first thing I'm gonna get is some food because obviously I'm starving. Well, I am starving. Ooh. How many? This one. You want butter? Yeah, a lot. Thank you. Do you have one too? Yeah. Butter? Yeah. And, uh, I got the corn just for the photo and the video, but I'm sure it's gonna be delicious. And it was like the hardest thing ever. Like it's rain, it's like drizzling. There's butter like seeping through. I asked for a lot of butter. I got me cider. And I'm gonna eat this and it's gonna be meat. Okay, let me try this first bite. Roasted corn. Mm. Yeah, it was good. Tastes like corn. Oh my god, actually this is amazing. It tastes like so fresh, like it's so good. Wow, it's really good. I got is hot dog. It was old fashioned one. It's two thirds beef, one third pork, and it has cream cheese and onions. Mmm, yum, yum, yum. The only thing that can be better than this is like a haunted house. Maybe I want to go to a haunted house. Oh, the pumpkins. Yeah, I'm not really going to get one. I didn't really realize that people really come here to buy pumpkins. It makes a lot of sense. It makes a lot of sense. But yeah, I'm too lazy. I used to have like a little baby pumpkin and we carved it into a jack-o'-lantern and we took out like all the guts and everything and it was like so much work. <sighs> I refuse to carve my own pumpkin. Unless I get to do it with someone, then I would. But we'd have to be recording. Oh, I already heard my belly button ring. Okay, I like accidentally hit it with my thumb. But I got cut a corn and it's caramel. Super excited. I'm taking this into the corn maze with me. No. You could do both no, mazes. They're just, um, if you look at the photo, I almost the, like went through the exit of the maze and I realized the exit of the maze. Oh my goodness, my first time going through the maze. This is so cool. This is so hard. I was not prepared for this. But I did have a feeling that this was like going to happen to me. But there's like people right in front of me. But yeah, this is my first time in a corn maze. Oh, I should take a picture. Yeah, I never in a million years would like sign up for this. So I brought some big caramel kettle corn with me so I could like eat while I get stuck in this maze. It's so cool though. Like, I just like walking. I'm just gonna take a walk. I hope I don't get stuck in here. But honestly, like if it was like real talk, me stuck in a corn maze in real life and it's like survival, I would obviously go through the corn maze in one direction until I get to the end. But yeah, this is kind of cool. The crossroads are like really lit. I love how they do it. I don't know what's gonna happen, but. I'm just gonna take a walk and eat some 
Kettle corn. This is so cool. Like I've never been one of these. The only thing would be better if it was like one of those scary ones. People was like popping out on you and stuff. Oh, I'll take a picture right here because it's really pretty. It's like a little trap. So I got to post one and I'm eating this and I'm just like chilling and walking around. You can kind of tell like where not to go because you see people like coming back. But honestly, I like I'm lost as fuck, but I don't want to look at them. I'm really wondering right how long you'd be stuck in this corn maze. I found number three and then according to this map, I'm all the way in like the corners. So like at the end of the side. And I was supposed to be punching them. I punched them. my three, I forgot to punch the one, but look, I'm all the way in the bottom. Jeez. So... <sighs> the maze is like so trapped of a map too, because it doesn't even show you like the right way. Like you can't draw your way through, so. So I found number four. I'm gonna try to follow these people that like really know like where they're going. I think I hear them. <laughs> That's like, I kind of want to get out of this maze. <laughs> Right now. Thought the corn maze was a joke. It's not. Look at this shit. I've been stuck in here for an hour. <laughs> I just suck at this. I tried to follow people. I lost them. I felt weird following people. It's so like went like different ways that people went. And I just keep thinking like if I came with one of you guys, you would be like, yeah, we go this way. No, we already went here. Like, but I'm like, where the fuck am I? Like, I literally, like, I'm tired of eating popcorn eat, like that much. And I feel like disoriented with like the direction. Like, this is like a serious corn maze. Like, you could legitly get lost in here, I feel like, forever. I'm not really sure where I should go next, but. I definitely don't belong in the wild, but I'm gonna follow these people. I just now. got caught into a loop that I just literally did before I showed you guys this. So I'm back here again. The people I said I was gonna follow once again, I was afraid of like following them, so I stopped. There's like a fallen corn stalk in this path, so I'm gonna take this path. Hopefully, we get out of here. Literally made less progress. We're down back. Well, it's the first time at two, but. I feel like we went the wrong way. I mean, obviously we went the wrong way. Because that was at four. I want to kind of get to six. Hey. Okay, so I feel like that was like the little round corner of the edge. And it felt like a lot of people came in through here. Oh, so back at two again. At one again, but this time I get to like punch it because I didn't the first time. No! I found number six. The paper looks like this. So I'm in the mouth right now. The Tyrannosaurus Rex. I did it all by myself. Oh, I did it all by myself. This maze is totally wrecking me. So I found number five. I almost just want to go back and to number six and try to find my way out from there. So I will go backwards. I can't believe my eyes. I thought I'd never see civilization again. But I do see civilization. And I can't believe my eyes. I made it out! Oh my god. Oh look, I like really made it out too, because that's the entrance. I can't believe I made it out of there. Oh my god. That was a lot. There's a second maze, but no. No, we're not doing that again. Hell to not. Nah. Well, at least made it out. I was afraid that I would get, like, come out through the entrance and I would have felt like, oh. But now I feel like accomplished, so that was kind of fun. I would do it with someone else. I don't really want to go in by myself again. I mean, I would, so. I mean, do everything by myself, so. But let's go look at the ghosty pumpkins. Favorite pumpkins. Two for six dollars. I wish I could like carve it with somebody. <sighs> okay, so we're gonna do what we do best. We're just gonna drink a hot beverage and see what else we can do. 